Welcome to the Evco channel. My name is Mike and we today are at the OC Transpo Bus Depot on Saint Laurent Boulevard to check out some electric buses. OC Transpo will no longer be buying diesel buses with four electric buses already in the fleet and the first 350 set to arrive over the next few years. All new buses going forward will be electric buses, starting with 40-foot buses and eventually replacing 60-foot and even double-deckers. As one of the organizations supporting OC Transpo's transition to electric vehicles, EVCO members were given a tour by staff of the OC Transpo facilities where they charge and maintain all of the electric buses. With the four bus pilot a success, OC Transpo is now expanding charging facilities and building new depots as well as renovating existing ones to accommodate all of the new buses planned to arrive in the fleet over the next few years. The 350 electric buses that OC Transfer will be acquiring over the next few years will be all housed at the Saint Laurent facility, which will require a new bus shed dedicated for e-buses only, a new power substation, and even solar panels on the roof of the new bus sheds. Electric buses use CCS for charging, which is an industry standard, but are otherwise just normal buses on the inside. What's most different for passengers is that e-buses are smoother, quieter, and have no emissions, so none of that diesel smell while you're standing at the curb waiting for a bus. All right, so we're in the depot, Basically. and Lawrence plugged in the bus, and now it's charging. So you can see there's a blue light flashing up on the charger. This is a CCS charger, 150 kilowatts, just like you'd have at any other charging station for a normal EV. And actually these buses can charge at a normal charging station, and you can charge your EV at the bus depot, if you're so inclined. So it's all just CCS standardized equipment. and. Uh, this bus also has a pantograph charger on the roof uh, that is actually a bit more space efficient because these, uh, these chargers take up ground, they take up floor space. And so OC Transpo in the future will be going with pantograph charging. Uh, the cost is the same, it's just it doesn't take up floor space, it's mounted from the ceiling. So um, pretty cool stuff. So this is a Siemens charger. It does the pantograph charging. I'm running into a post behind me. Okay, let's go all the way up. Over to the top of the bus.